Welcome back. This is Anime Spring Tournament Cup 57-54. Fourth quarter is the Sult Sultan versus John and the group play of the tournament. Before I start recording, just a, a shout out and a thought and a prayer for Dimitri Thompson and his family. And we're thinking of him and we're back in the gym tonight for the first time in three weeks. And uh, we're playing with our hearts heavy and on our minds. Guys are wearing the black wristbands in memoriam of Meech. Mello Bates, who's really had to really had to dig deep to, to come tonight, but he came. All the guys came. And we've got a good one here. 59, 57, 10 minutes to go. The tournament group play was created because we only had a we, you know, we lost three weeks, so we had to figure out what to do with the three games remaining when we made the decision, talking to the inner circle and the guidance that we got. It was okay to resume and guys wanted to come back. So we came up with group play and everybody's playing two games. Today is Friday and then on Sunday and then the top four advance is Liam Gillen, who is a replacement and a close friend, squad X player, close friend of Meech. And uh, he took a replacement for Jerome Ricks, uh, the Sultan's big man who dropped. They also lost Dayton to an injury. So he's he's been picked up for the tournament. It's essentially a new new season. There's a three by John Fuentes. And so I think John is now up 62 to 60. And I got distracted, sorry. I saw somebody go down behind me. Okay, so Rod hits a three and a 63-62. So let's, let's do the game. Mello. Guarded by Rod, gets a screen. Mello, pull up mid-range, spin a shot. No, nope, no good. Rod rests it down one hand. Guarded tightly, Zach. One point game. Rod is saying he got fouled. Vaughn's like, I didn't do anything. Zach, sidestep three. Splash. Four point lead now for the Sultans. John, I believe, has been up a lot of the game, but it's been close. Sultans now, four-point lead. This might be their biggest lead of the game. I'm not sure. Behind me, it's a blowout. Razo showed up with five players. Then Marcus with three superstar. Musa, and he splashes it. And there's a whistle. I don't know what just happened. Does it count? But over here, Musa is on the bench there. He sat out at halftime, said his knee was hurting. So that left him a four because there's three other guys missing. Uh, and it's just turned into a rout. It's just turned into a rout. Well, with the tournament, you can't win by more than 30, I think, when a team has four, which they do now. They only have four guys. Uh, so, Commissars had to, for the volunteer team to play back-to-back -to -back tonight, and they got essentially a freebie, almost like a warm-up. They haven't really had to do much since uh, the end of the second quarter. So, anyways, here we go. Back here, the close game. And there is a point differential. We did use a season to uh, give some PD to the teams. That's a turnover. They didn't need that seven minutes ago. So John finished in the third place of the standing. So they were given, I think, plus six. So they're plus six right now in point differential as is, no, I'm sorry. I think John is a one seed. So they're plus nine. And the Sultans, I think, were plus six. So that's the advantage they got for where they finish in the season. Mel's telling everybody to get out. They're crowding him. Mel wants to take it to Zach. Backs him down. Backs him down. Turn. Block. No foul. Rod. Zach. Drives. Layup is good. I never know why. And there's a bucket there, 68. Yeah, we're gonna do what? There's Rod, 68, 65. Apologies if I'm a little distracted tonight. It's uh, our first night back after what happened and uh, there's no playbook for this, so. We're all a little distracted, but we're, we're here. That's part of healing, right? Move on and Live, take the next steps and 
you know, do it together. What are they talking about? Dinner plans? No. Oh, no, they were saying who had the ball. So now it's going to John. And John Ball. So five and a half to go. And a three-point game. And it is a good game here. Fuentes. Screen. Doesn't take it. Goes the other way. John. A lot of contact. And one. John Fuentes. <laughs> Gets a little dab from Deb. One point game. And we've got a good one here. 68, 67. Five minutes to go. Again, on the point there, Mitchell, if I have it right, because, you know, it's only written down my computer at home. Plus nine for John, plus six for Sultans. If you want to get a win column, then you get two games. So if you win both your games, you're pretty much automatically in. You win your group. If you go one and one, that PD is going to be the determining factor against everybody else's one and one. So tied game, 4.30 to go. Zach. Dom wants to screen with Liam. Tells Zach to clear, gets the screen, Dom, three, way off, and it's out, and it's going to John. Rod is arguing, not sure, not sure what it was. 4-12 to go, John. A three! I didn't see who did the three. I told you I'm distracted. I just saw one of my guys down on the ground, but he's up now. I'm a little, I don't like seeing that right now. So, all right, anyways, Dom driving. Blocked by Romello. Ball out of bounds. 71-68. Maybe Mike at the three. And now Sid calls timeout for the Sultan. All right, off the out of bounds play. Here we go. Three minutes to go. 15 seconds. Zach. This is the ball. Yeah, no, it saves it. Oh, no, it's off that guy, I think. Turnover. Ball going to Chun. There we go. Three point lead for John. John Fuentes. Off to Mike. Mike. Back to John. Steal. Rod. Dumb. It's a three on three. Overthrows a Liam. Steal back. Mello. Got Fuentes wide open, John for three, short. Aaron rebound. Gaines picking up an intensity, a couple minutes left. Zach for the tie, slash! Zach Pope, 71 all, two and a half to go. I can see the feeling in Romello, he does not want to lose this. Mike, screen, Mello. Marcus, back to Mello. Mello really close to the beach. And the floater, no good! Liam. Rod, Rod all the way, now kicks out to Dobbs. Dobbs with another three. Off, Mello rebound. We're still tied at 71, under two to go. John, John, crossover, nothing. Nothing, he'll bring it back out. Wants to go to the rim and gets the foul on Leo. One forty-two left, seventy-one all. John Fuentes will go to the line. Looks like he'll be shooting two. Big free throws coming up here. First one is good. Oh, the usual guys. Yeah, the usual guys. Fox running will stop at a minute. Second free throw for John. All right, strokes both. John up by two. Rod will take it. Rod is asking for a foul. Doesn't get it. Now he gets by John. Rod. Spin move. Layup. Good. Got a double team, Rod. I just say that without basically just saying like that's unstoppable. <laughs> one guy's not gonna stop that. One minute to go. Tie game. We got a good one. Big one for the group play. Mello, John, Mike, 
Justin. They're waiting for something to happen. Amelo grab it now. He's guarded by Rod. Gets the screen from Mike. Now they double. Nope, switch back. Melo, that's a foul. Yes, it is. Rod Melo draws it. I don't know. That's two shots. Yep, fifth foul. But Melo will go to the line to shoot two. Lisa. Why don't we pray and then do the huddle and then... Okay. No. No good on the first free throw. Melo, second one. Looks short. No, splash. Misread it. One point lead. John. John needs to stop. Sultans need a basket. Aaron. Aaron, and there's a foul. Foul on Justin. That's the fourth team foul. Fourth team foul. So the next one will put him in the bonus. Yusuf. Don't talk to him. Yusuf. Sorry. Aaron. Sorry. Timeout. I've been distracted by Brisky right here on camera. <laughs> Turn my commentary. Let's fly. I'll be like, that's a foul. All right, 24 seconds left. Down one of the Sultans. Let's see what they drew up. Liam off the screen. Rod is wheeling out to the other side. They're going to go. Oh, almost a steal. Nope, Zach gets it. Now Rod comes top. They're going to run a pick and roll. No, nope, it's ice on the Rod. Fakes. Spin move. Step through. Layup. That's just too easy. 11.9 left. Melo. 10 seconds. The full court press. Slow him down. Eight. Melo. Melo, step! That's for the lead! That was short! It's short! Oh, they call foul! A mic! And it's three seconds left! And Romelo had a great move, and the shot was just short. It's just short. He got the move, he got the look. It didn't go. Rod will go to the line to shoot two. Shot that two. Shoot two free throws. Still time. I don't know if John has any timeouts left. Rod will go. Rod is highly unlikely to miss these. It's just the sharpshooter that I've seen him. And I, I jinxed him. He misses one. Still. Yeah. Okay, so they do have a timeout. So they're going to call a timeout. That means they'll be, a, they'll be able to advance the ball up to half court. Rod, second free throw, good. Timeout, John. It's a two point game and they'll advance. All right, let's see what John drew up. Three seconds left. You've got Melo, you've got Mike, you've got Fuentes. Fuentes has hit a big game winning, or we thought it was a game winning shot last season in the playoffs before Romelo hit a miracle three at the buzzer. But here we go. Melo. Oh, it's a lob play for John! And it worked! We're going to overtime! Are you kidding me? What a play! What a freaking play! 76 all, and we're going to overtime. All right, so we're gonna do the Elam rule like we always do, is first to five. Uh, if at the end of five minutes, they have not hit it, it'll be next basket wins, or uh, we'll put a minute on the clock and whatever the score is at the end of that minute. So that'll be at 8.40, so. I told him not to do the clock to go with the clock. All right, here's Mike, jumper, no good. Fuentes, rebound. Justin, Marcus, that's his shot. No good. Zach, Cope, rebound. And we've got already a great first tournament game, an overtime game between Jun and Sultans. And Rod gets the foul. Hey. Good. Rod, one for three on his last three free throws. Oh, 
Makes that one, 77, 76. Winner is 81. Hey, he made one, right, Thomas? They gave him two. He only made one. That's right. No good on the free throw. Big shots being missed by the guys. One point lead for Sultans. Winner is 81. And up. Oh, he was out. John was out on the steal. So, Paul will say with Sultans. I'll tell you what, John is playing D tonight. Not just, the whole team is. They are, they are all, all in. I'm seeing a lot of dedicated, focused, physical defense by John. Zach drives in. Floater is short. Got a good look. It doesn't hit. Mello, two minutes to go. We're not supposed to be using clock. All right, whatever. Um, instinctively, Mello for three. Oh, in and out. Zach gets the rebound. One point lead for Sultans. Duh, he'll drive. No good. Gets the rebound. Oh, missed the layup. Gets another rebound. Zach, Rod, open. Splash. They need one more point. And his game, Mello. Step through, Mike. Fakes, Mike. They need this. No good. Sultans can win with a point. Rod. Rod will drive. Nobody there. He got caught. Saved by Heron. Tom. And this is for the game. And that's, oh, it's in and out. Mello. The hesitation work gets the layup and it's good. It's down, down to two. And I guess we're doing clock. I, they didn't follow the overtime rules. Well, it is five minutes on so first to five. No foul, Mello, long, done. this is past. John brings it out. Mike, Marcus. For three, John, 